there everybody welcome to another music comparison video if you haven't seen my first comparison video yet where I compared the music with Conker's Bad Fur Day and it's remastered on the Xbox I'll leave a link to it in the description down below and now if you haven't uh, seen my first one yet uh, the way this goes is we listen to uh, like songs from both versions of a game like for example like the main menu music in Star Fox 64 we're going to listen to it 60 and 64 version and also the DS version and I'll decide which one uh, sounds a lot better. By the way, this is all just my opinion. Now the first song we're going to listen to is the main menu music. First, here's the N64 version. Now here's the 3DS version. Now between the two, um... The 3DS version, with the sound of the piano, uh, I think it gives off a more beautiful, a more relaxing vibe than, uh, than what the N64 version gives. Uh, the N64 version is really awesome. Uh, for the longest time, uh, I actually loved that version a lot more than the DS version. But, the 3DS version, in my opinion, is a lot better. The next song we're gonna listen to is the Mission Failed music. First, the N64 version. version. Now, between the two, um, the way, uh, the 3DS version sounds, um, at the very start of it, it doesn't really give that feel to it like like the sad feeling when uh like you like fail a mission or when you just uh lose any game in general um the, the n64 version the way it starts off it definitely uh keeps it that way it definitely makes it feel like you actually did fail the mission but it didn't really feel that way with the 3ds version and yes i know it starts getting a little bit faster after about 10 or 15 seconds but it, it just felt like the 3DS version didn't have that feel to it that you actually did fail your mission. But yep, with this song, the mission fail music goes to the N64 version. The third song that we're going to be comparing is the Aqua's music. That's the level where you're underwater in the blue submarine. First, we're going to listen to the N64 version. Now, the 3DS version. And now, with the 3DS version, um, well, the feels that you get, like the sound of the music, like when you go into, uh, like a water kind of, water themed, uh, level or dungeon or whatever in a video game, it feels like the 3DS version kind of took that away. 
Uh, you, it definitely feels like you're in a water level with when you hear the N64's mus music, but when you hear it on the 3DS, it just feels like you're in a different kind of level. So yeah, it just feels like the 3DS version of Aqua's music just takes away the vibe that you're in a like that you're in a water level. So definitely with this one, it I would say the N64 version is a lot better. Now number four is Katina's theme. Here is the N64 version. Now the 3DS version. This music in general sounds like to me just like a normal battle theme when you go against enemies. Um, it the way it sounds like the way it sounds on the 3DS version. In my opinion, like the way from what's going on, like in level, like trying to defeat those alien ships and all with uh, Bill's men, kind of like you're on an actual battlefield and all. Um, I say it definitely fits. Uh, the theme of the level a lot more in the 3DS version. Uh, the, the N64 version does sound pretty good, but in my opinion, from what's going on, like for the theme of the actual level, I think the 3DS version just sounds a lot better. Now, the fifth and final song that we're going to compare from the games is Sector Y Solar. First, N64 version. version. how to explain myself with this one like I did the others so I'm just going to get straight to the point I honestly think that the N64 version of it sounds a lot better well that's all the songs but we're not done yet guys just like in my first music comparison video my friend Ryan would love to give his opinion on these songs also Ryan Oh, hey there, guys. I didn't see you here. I was actually just about to... Oh, this is what we're filming for. I got you. Hey, guys, what's going on? It is here. It is me, DeBoss, with a uh, another set of clips to show you wonderful people and another music comparison video that I am doing with my friend Patrick Barrett, as you guys are watching it on his channel. Um, today, I will be giving my thoughts and comparisons over the 3DS version of Star Fox as well as the original version. So let's just get right into it with the first set, which is from the title screen. Now... Out of the five clips, this is actually the one that I find the most original out of the entire set. If I had to pick my favorite between the two, I'm probably going to end up going with um, the original title music. And the reason that I say that is just because it has a more space for It's more original, I feel. There's a lot more of a... Uh, you get to feel like there's some nice instruments, nice, some nice smooth jazz, like with, all, with also the space vibe. So I feel like the more... Not so modern versions better. So I'm going to go with the original version for my uh, answer. The second Star Fox uh, music clips that I'm going to be comparing is the Mission Failed music from the 3DS version and the N64 version. For this one, I'm actually going to go with the 3DS version. And that's simply due to the fact that I love the more modern tone for the music. I feel like it has a lot more bounce. 
It's a lot more uh, epic sounding, which is saying something for a mission failed menu, but in this case, the more modern version is better than the original, I feel, and that's why I'm going with 3DS. For the third set of Star Tra um, for Star Fox tracks, we're actually going to be going with the Aquos uh, theme from both the N64 and the 3DS version. For this one, I'm going to go with the original again, just because I love the bounciness of it. I love the drums, the suspenseful music playing as you're tra going over through more on your journey. I feel like that music's better than the original version on the 3DS. Oh, well, not the original, I should say, the more modern version. But I'm going to go with the N64 again. Up next for number four on the Star Fox um, music list is uh, the, the Katina theme song from the N64 and the 3DS version, which, comparing the two, um, I am actually going with the uh, the original again, and this is because it's more epic sounding. I feel like the more than the 3DS version, it's more bouncy, it's more joyful, and it makes you feel like more ep like you're on an epic quest of sorts, and I feel like the original does that way better than the 3DS, so I'm going with the original. And for the fifth and final Star Fox uh, selection here, we have the Solar Y... Uh, theme music from the original and as well as from the 3DS. For this one, I'm actually going to go back to the 3DS, and the reason I say that was the original, I think, was pretty well composed for the time, but the problem is I feel like the 3DS was better made, it was better composed, and the, I'm not saying the original is bad, because it's not. It actually sounds pretty good, especially for when it was made. Just, I prefer the 3DS version. So, guys, those were my thoughts on uh, which uh, soundtracks that I found to be better on Star Fox. Hope you guys enjoyed watching Patrick's video. And, uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys whenever I see you next on this channel. Peace. Well, there you have it, guys. Both me and Ryan think that the original had much better music than the 3DS version. Alright, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. We're gonna do another one of these music comparison videos sometime soon, hopefully within the next month. But I gotta figure out which game I'm gonna do that with. I know Diddy Kong Racing and uh, Donkey Kong Country 2 uh, got another game uh, on the on the 3DS. I might compare uh, one of those two games. You never know. But alright guys, thanks so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Also, hit the bell notification if that. <laughs> hit that bell notification so you don't miss my uploads. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching. See you on the next video. Goodbye.